Good day. I am Kristen Mary Cipinido, B.Ed. 2 student. For today's recording, I will be presenting the different reading comprehension tools. So, the first reading comprehension tools is so what we called graphic organizers. Graphic organizers are visual and graphic displays that organize ideas and demonstrate relationships between different information and concepts. Graphic organizers enhance reading comprehension by helping students to categorize information and to show the relationships among important concepts. The different kinds of graphic organizers are Venn diagram, T-charts, concept maps, and flowcharts. And here is the example of graphic organizers. The second reading comprehension tools is so what we called graphs. Graphs is a diagram that shows numerical data in a visual form. Graphs enables us to see relationships that are difficult to describe the numbers alone. The different kinds of graphs are pie graph, bar graph, and line graph. And here is the example of graphs. The third reading comprehension tools is so what we called charts. Charts is a strategy that enables students to gather information about a topic from several sources. Students read or listen to several sources on the topic and record answers to the post questions within the charts. And here is the example of a chart. The fourth reading comprehension tools is so what we called webs. Webs is a special kind of graphic aid for teaching students to look at both sides of an issue before drawing a conclusion. They help students to organize their thinking, examine other points of view, and draw a richer understanding from the materials they read. And here is the examples of a webs. The PF reading comprehension tools is so what we call maps. Maps is a strategy that uses a graphic organizer to help students learn the elements of a book or story by identifying story characters, plot, setting, problem, and solutions. The different kinds of maps are story map and concept map. And here is the examples of a maps. The sixth reading comprehension tools is what we called timeline. Timeline is to understand chronological events while they are gaining English vocabulary to expand their oral and written skills. Students can create simple timelines in which they describe a day in their life, what happened in a story they just heard or read. And here is the example of a timeline. The seventh reading comprehension tools is so what we called diagrams. Diagrams is a graphical devices that illustrate the relationship between two or more variables using points, lines, or differentiated parts of a whole. The different kinds of diagrams are pie graph, line graph, and bar graph. And here is the example of diagrams. Again, the different reading comprehension tools are graphic organizers, graphs, charts, webs, maps, timelines, and diagrams. Thank you for listening!